What's going on? It's Scotty here with another supplement review. Today's supplement review will be Shadow X by Cobra Labs. Um, first of all, I've tried the Curse pre workout. I would definitely say it's definitely in my top five pre workouts. Definitely, actually, to be honest, it's definitely in my top three. So when I heard about Shadow X, I definitely thought, gotta, gotta try it. Um, What can I say about it? Um, obviously the tub I've got here is £29.99 which is £10 more than the case um, and there's only 30 servings in here whereas I think the case is 50 servings per tub for £20 so there's quite a bit of a price difference there although for case I think uh, you have to put in like two scoops so if you look at it that way, this does actually last um, about five more workouts. I should only do need to put in one scoop for this one, at least for me anyway. And to be honest, I've got quite a high tolerance for, st for uh, stimulants, which of course is what um, these pre-workouts are. Um, obviously, if I go look for the flavour on it, it's Neon Tropic, which is, I haven't tasted any pre-workouts that have been anything similar to this. Um, do I think it tastes nice? Not really. Um, I wouldn't say the flavour is that good. Um, I can appreciate the company going out of the way to, to try to develop a new flavour. But for me, it didn't work too well for me. I mean, it's not awful. I mean, I've had some awful taste in pre workouts before. It's definitely not awful, but I think they could have just stuck to something more original for this. Um, as far as the effects, um, to be honest, I think it's quite a shame. Um, it was definitely a bit of a letdown for me personally. Um, obviously, as I said, I just put the one scoop in. Normally, the case I put in two, but I put one scoop in. And to be honest, you be I, I was training really, really well for the first half an hour, and then it's just a crash. Um, and for me, I do all my compound exercises to begin with, and then. After I do them, obviously I work more on my isolation. And when it came to working my isolation sets, I was just completely drained. Um, I, I was yawning more, I felt a lot more tired. So, um, that was it basically. If, if, you, if I felt a lot more tired, uh, I couldn't really work out. So, I think if you're going to be training for half an hour, then that's spot on. <laughs> If you want to pre work out where you will, if you, want to, if you want to be training at night time and you're worried about getting to sleep, maybe you might want to try it because it will send you straight to sleep after about half an hour. As I said, I mean, if you want to work, if you wanted to, like for me personally, if I was going to go on the treadmill for half an hour, then I might have, I might take it um, for, the energy, for the initial energy rush for that half an hour, I'll be on the treadmill. But if that was going to be my whole week, I was just a half an hour on the treadmill, then I'd probably take it. Other than that, um, to be honest, it's not good for me. I've still got half a tub left. And the reason for this is because I've, I'm currently uh, stacking it with another pre workout, um, which kind of just prolongs it a bit longer. Um, and there isn't the crash. Um, so when I stack it with something else, it does work quite well. On its own, for me personally, it's a no go. Uh, would I recommend it? I mean, I've, I've read a lot of reviews about this prior to buying it, obviously, and a lot of people, like a lot of reviews, went to uh, great on it. But as a big fan of Cobra Labs, I still decided to try it. So I think if anyone else has tried the curse and they liked it, then you're probably going to try it anyway. <laughs> um, if you can get a sampler, um, like a one serving sampler, then I would definitely, definitely recommend getting one of them, just for, just for, for you. I mean, to be honest, I haven't tried using like half a scoop and seeing if that works any better, um, which might, might work a bit better, but I can't honestly say it. Seems so I usually have quite a few extra scoops in my pre-workout, to be honest. Um, so, as far as the taste goes, I wouldn't say it's too pleasant. Uh, value for money, um, as I said for me, I, I get the crash. So, 
to me, I won't be buying it again. I don't think if they improved on it, I'd give it a chance. Um, I'd, I'd, I'd definitely like Cobra Labs as a supplement company, so I'd definitely give it another go if it was redone. But for this specific one, obviously not the specific dub, but this specific uh, Shadow X supplement, I won't be trying it again. Um, so I'd say the value for me isn't too good. I mean, thirty pounds for me for pre rig I'll just play a bit. So I expect a lot more. I mean, if there wasn't a crash and I could trim my whole week out from it, then I would definitely go to higher rating. But yeah, out of ten, I'd possibly have to go with about a six. Um, and the taste will be much higher than a six either. Um, I said I appreciate Cobra Labs uh, making a new supplement, but for me personally, no go. That's all. See you later.